people welcome to canvas crafts my name is kim and if you're new here hello welcome if you're returning welcome back guys love you we are here with an amazon haul slash i won something <laughs> yeah i actually won something on instagram from bella art day nicole this is my first ever anything from them um tray wise and yeah it was one of those you know uh comment below you know you have to follow us comment below and then um tag a friend so i tagged debbie and yeah we we won we want to tray. This is my first tray, so I'm really excited because I've always wanted to try their trays. I've heard nothing but great things, uh, but every time I happen to go on their website, they're sold out, um, and I, I just never seem to get there in time. So I think most of the people in the diamond art community, they are familiar with Bella Art Dana Cole. It is a military family, Jamie and Nicole, and they um, are small business. So I've been dying to try one of their trays. Very pretty. Uh, yeah, so her, I've heard that that's her favorite butterflies, so love it. And, oh, I've won two trays. Two... I don't know what size what size these are. Um, I'm guessing these are their small trays. Oh, so cool. So here's their lids, they slide. And they're actually not hard to slide. I just was, um, I think I, I was pushing down more than I was pushing out. But it seems like if you pull, see how easy that is? They do snap into place. Wow, this is very, very nice. And then here's the stopper. I mean, <laughs> everyone watching this probably has a million of her trays and I'm just in awe. I got one, I got one. Look how pretty this is too. It's got like a um like a light baby blue and then like a galaxy blue i love it it is so pretty so very cool and then i got a pink one i love it so thank you bella art day nicole jamie and nicole now i'm gonna have to buy more now aren't i I'm getting feelings here. <laughs> very cool. And they stack on top of each other very nicely. I love it. Thank you guys. So yeah, Debbie won trays too. So that's the first part. The second part is my Amazon haul. And I don't... Um, know what's all in here because this has been like collecting for a minute now um so we're just gonna grab a package and jump on in let's see what we got here oh yeah so i have my april coasters so these are for may okay and I thought these were so cute. I couldn't, I couldn't resist. And I thought, okay, May, Mother's Day, May flowers. So I was gonna get flowers, but then I saw these and I was like, nope, that's it. This is what we're getting. They're all different shapes, which I just thought was so cute. And they're honeybee. Themed. So this is a bee in a honeycomb, and then this is a beehive. I'm terrified of bees, but here we are. 
Here's another honeycomb in B. And then, what is this? <laughs> what is this? I don't know. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. Is this French toast? But we love it. We love it. And then this is a sunflower with a bee on it. And this is just a happy bee. And then here's a flower. And then a honey pot. And then another bee. So yeah, so how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Honey pot is big. Two honey pots. Different, different, they look different though. One is bigger than the other. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They do not have cork bottoms and they're all different shapes. So I will have to get my cork bottoms out and just like cut, like I will just have to cut a circle, uh, like a, uh, a circle here and then like whatever there. So I will cut cork bottoms for them but I just thought they were so cute and the different shapes just made it a little more fun. Now in it, we got a basic tool kit with a pen, a square of wax, and then your green boat. And let's go ahead and look at the drills here. So I have been saying that I, I, I think I prefer the rhinestone ones. So I did want to get another rhinestone one. And these are the colors. So this is like a like a grayish, I guess. And then we have like a dark topaz. And then we have regular black. And then we have that pretty copper. And then we have this teal or aquamarine. And then we have the white crystals. And then more of just like the dark browns and oranges and then yellows. I mean, they're be it's bees and honey, right? So we got a lot of these honey and brownish colors. I think even though there's 10 of them, I think some, some of them are so small that, you know, it's not going to be like a super long project. Very cute. I'm very happy with them. I'm just gonna pack this up. All right, so that was bag one, score. All right, let's see what's in this, what's in this. So I do know that I have some face washing stuff in here. Um, I just wanna tell you guys about this, what I think might be a little face washing trick. What is this? Okay, so, and I and this was in another package, so I just put it on the table. These are metal tips, and I got another, I got a pen. Now, the reason why I got this pen is because it was cheaper to get the pen with the thing of metal tips with it than it was to just get the metal tips. Um, so just look at your, you know, look at your prices when you're shopping. Um, which I'm sure everybody does, but, um, yeah, I was going to just get metal tips, but it was like $3 more and, it, and it was like, Hey, if you get this pen with it, we'll, we'll send you all the tips for $3 less. And I was like, okay, um, yeah, I'll take the pen. So it's a, it's on the thinner side, which honestly, sometimes I want. So it's a nice option. It comes with these thick multi placers and I'm trying to get more into these metal multi placers because I'm tired of how the plastic ones start to get misshapen by the drills. I'm a very hard presser and so they start to get mis misshapen and then the single, so I got a bunch of single, single tips here. Um, I don't know if I'm going to like these or not, but I'm, I want to really give it a good go and really, really, um, give it a good shot. 
and work with these tips because the brass tips, I tend to bend when I try to get my wax or my glue dot out with my tweezer. They just get misshapen and it's, I can't stand it. It's, it's one of my, um, what do they call those now? X. Yeah, it icks me. <laughs> so, ooh, look how shiny they are. They look so pretty. So I have been really using a metal placer. Um, I've been using this one. You can see there's a, there's a drill on it. And I've been using this one which is like a rose gold. So I'm just trying to get more of them because that way I don't have to change pens too often. Oh, I didn't even realize this had two single tips. I probably would not have bought all of these, but so there you go. So I have all these metal tips now. I'm going to try to get into, so this one has this single tip on it that I bought from Amazon. And it's really awesome. I really love this metal tip. It's, it looks like a, a lot different, right? But it's expensive. So I'm really trying to get into these, these metal tips because they're much more reasonable. And I will link all of these below so you can see what they're costing. So this one has eight of these. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm going to really work hard at getting used to using these metal tips. And I got a pen basically for free and it saved me $3 is how I looked at it. So there you go. So there's that one. Let's see what's in this box. What's in the box? You guys know I love seeing that little meme. Okay, so I told you guys, I I got a face brush. I know, I, I'm just showing you all my things here because I've been using this brush on my face in the shower and it just makes it feel so clean. What I do at night is I just lather it with hyaluronic acid um and i honestly feel like my face just feels looks lifted like i've never had any kind of injections botox nothing and it, you know i'm getting to the point where it's like hmm maybe i want to look into it a little <laughs> but i think that with these bristles do is they kind of like give you like little micro tears. And then when I put that hyaluronic acid in there, it just eats it up and um, really plumps out the skin. I mean, think about it. You ever hear of the micro needling? So that's honestly what they're doing, right? They're, they're puncturing these little holes into your face and then they're putting all of the stuff in it and it's letting it absorb right into this this the face so i got this gel cleanser that has vitamin c and uh glycolic acid and so i'm going to wash my face with this combination here okay and then i got a hundred percent pure hyaluronic acid serum and I'm gonna slather that on and I'll tell you guys I've been doing this with a different brush that doesn't rotate or anything for three nights and I see a huge difference already but I will update you on this in my whipping chats because I'm really excited about I'm gonna start this regimen tonight so that was just a little little extra. I have no idea. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so I got these because you know I'm doing the 
I got the mini cross stitch conversions that I'm doing. I'm printing up, so I got these um, in case I need to add. Also for my journals, because I've been doing uh, something else. So these are double sided adhesive rolls, all different sizes here. I think there's two of each size, except for the big guy here. And yeah, I I got all of these sizes. So I can like, so I can tape things. <laughs> yeah, and so it's, um, you roll it off here. You roll it off of here. So let's cut a little piece and I'll show you. So you roll it off of here. I have a piece of yellow paper here and then you put it down right and then when you peel it off it leaves the adhesive behind and so you can like if you're if you're in your journal and you want to tape down a picture perfect how great is that this would be great for gift wrapping wrapping too I can't believe I didn't know about this stuff. Like, I, I don't know, how did I make it to 40X and not know about this stuff? I don't even know. I don't know. Okay, so we'll save this big box for last. Let's see what we got in here. So the face thing was just a little extra, extra. Uh, I mean, I... I'm at that age where, well, I've been at that age. I mean, let's face it. Yas. So I got a bunch of crystals, square crystals. The reason why I did this is because I have these cross-stitch conversions that I'm printing now. And yeah, I wanted to use this on them. Can I get it open? Come on, come on. So let's, I can't remember. So I, I don't think these are the same as what Angie got. Angie got a really great deal, but she's in Canada and I could not find what she got. So this is from Forever Young. It says, thank you very much. And honestly, I think it's 40 colors. I thought it was more than a thousand drills each, but it looks like only a thousand drills each. I'll put it in the corner there because I can't remember, but let's see what colors I got. I, I feel like it should be more than this, but so we have black 310, 154, 550. 153, 915, 796, 995, 3808, 943, 909, 703, 741, 725, 947, 815-666-3328-3607-945 and 5200. And honestly, they look huge. I'm scared. They look bigger than like diamond painting drills. Or is it just because they're crystals? No, when I see when I see the non- when I see them on the non-silver side, they look like normal drills. Hmm. So I will have to put in the corner there how much is in each bag. I guess it's just a thousand. So how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 20. 20 drills? Hold on. Yeah, so it's 20 bags, 20 colors, 1,000 in each bag. So 20,000 pieces is what I ended up getting. Um, I couldn't find... I think she got like 170 some colors. The most I could find was 40 of the square and it was only a thousand per bag uh, or some or something like that. So I, I opted for the 20. I should have gotten the 40, honestly, guys. I don't know why I didn't, but I think it's because I saw that it had pretty much all the colors that I needed for the next project that I'm thinking about um, printing and doing. But I don't know, maybe I'll end up getting the 41 too, but I, I, I would love to get the one that, uh, if you don't know who I'm talking about, it's Angie's Crafting with Diamonds, and she has a video on her uh, crystals that she ordered. But yeah, so that's what I ended up getting. And I'll package that up when we're done. All right, one more box to go. Let's see what we got. Also, with the face stuff, guys, make sure you patch test if you decide to try it um, and make sure you're not sensitive to anything, you know, like the bristles and all of that. Like, obviously, you know, I'm just telling you what I'm going to be doing on my face, but I don't know how everybody's face will react. Oh, yeah. So... You know, I love my storage, storage, so I got another storage set. It looks a little different. <laughs> I broke the bag. Um, it looks a little different, so I got these pods. They're individual pods. How do they open? Not easily, so that's good. There's not really much of a lip. But they see, they're huge cubes, right? So they seem like they'll hold quite a bit. Although you gotta be careful because you see how it's raised here? I'll have to see how that works. So, but um, how many we have? 28, 28 times three. Oh man, now you really get me doing some math. 28 times three, three times eight is 24. Three times two is six, seven, eight, 84. So we got 84 pods here in three bins. Don't tell me you're cracked. Nope, you're not cracked. And they all open and close like that. So I wonder, can they fit like this? Yeah, they can, because they're, they're cubes. Yeah, so that's how I would do them. I would have it so that the opening is facing me, like this. So yeah, you could kit up multiple small projects, three small projects. You, you could kit up one large project. Um, they hold quite a bit, it seems. So yeah, I'm excited to try these. They are not attached, so you can just kit up and then rearrange however you arrange your stuff by color, by symbol, whatever it is that you do, you know. I'm just making sure that they'll fit in here like this. I did these two.
I don't even think, do I have, I have a lot of these backwards. It's hard to tell which side is the front and which side's the back. Like, look, look at me. I have all of these backwards up here. I can see it now. Now I can see. I, I put them. I put all of them in backwards. Well, not all of them. This one's okay. Jeez. How did I mess that up? See, I was, I, 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 I had this on my wish list and I was like back and forth and back and forth about it because I'm like, well, I like all of these little cubes. And um, then I thought about it and I was like, well, the bottles are all separate. I think so. So that's how I would have them. Some of them are very hard to... Oh, you, you got to pinch them from the side and then they pop open. Oh. Very cool because they are very, very tight. Oh, I love it. Okay, so if I need this color, is it hard to get out? Not really. I need this color. All right, I need you. I mean, it's not the easiest, but it's definitely doable. So I'm not going to sit here and put them all in the same order in front of you, even though I desperately want to because it's bothering me. It's really arcing me. But I will do that once I turn the camera off. <laughs> That's my Amazon haul. Okay. Oh, and an honorable mention, my timer. I got on Amazon. I opened it up. Um, oh, it's got some <laughs> putty on it. I love this thing. This thing's awesome because you hit this big button and um, it goes seconds and minutes and it does go all the way. There's a, oh, a hundred and I guess it goes to 199 minutes. Um, and then it's this big button for start and stop and it keeps your time on there until you reset it. So if you start a square and you hit this and then you then you you're like okay I have to go to the bathroom. You stop it, you come back, it's still there. Then you just start again. And then you're like okay, I have to go eat. You stop it and it's still there and then when you're done the square, you just hit reset. So that's how I've been keeping track and I it's been very 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 helpful. Um I love it. I love this thing and it just, cause it has the biggest button ever. So you, <laughs> you don't have to think about anything. You're not accidentally touching a different number. You're not accidentally resetting it in the middle of your square. It's, um, it's very, very, very easy to do. So let's recap guys. We have multi-placer metal tips and a pen. We have single multi, I mean, single metal tips, a bag of them. We have our honey pot B coasters for um, May. I have an 84 large cubed diamond painting storage. Very cool. We have 20 colors at a thousand a piece diamond painting crystals, squares. It's very easy to find the round crystals at the 174 colors, but not the square. The square is more difficult. I have my multiple sizes of double-sided adhesive tape. Multiple sizes. There's two, four, six, eight, nine different si rolls and five different sizes because there's two of the smallest, two of the Two of the extra small, two of the small, two of the medium, two of the large, and one of the extra large. And then my face cleaning regimen that I'm going to start doing at night. Yes. I will let you guys know how this works out for me. I'm excited about it. 
So that is all I have for you guys today. If you like this video, if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up on the way out. And if you want to see more from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and join the family and friends here at Kimba's Crafts. I would love to have you. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care. Keep diamond painting.